Yo, 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 yo! Welcome back, everybody. This video, I'm gonna be ranting a little bit and showing you my newest pickup. So first, let's get into the pickups. We got two CGC books. Pretty happy to have these, very proud. First one's gonna be Silk, 9.6. Now I'm very proud because uh, I eyeballed this myself off of eBay. I got this for, I think, 55 or $60, not CGC'd. This was a raw book and um, the guy I was selling was 9.2 and it looked phenomenal, man. It looked just phenomenal. You probably can't tell, um, but it's it's just flawless, man. It's impeccable right here, man. Just all around, man, this is a beauty, man. You guys know I love me some silk. Oh man, I, I just love her so much. Look at her, man. Look at her, look at that sketch, man. This is silk when she was being drawn like a boss, you know what I mean? Now she's like a little kid, whatever, but she's awesome. And the next beauty, another silk, but this is a 9.8. And yes, I eyeballed this. I think it was probably from the same guy. It was a 9.2, that's what he was selling as. I really like that when eBay sellers do that, man. I do that myself. If I think it's like a 9.6, I try not to get in trouble. I do like 9.2, you know what I mean? I probably wouldn't even say 9.4. I say I can guarantee like a nine, maybe 9.2, but um, can't guarantee a 9.6. Even if I think it's a 9.6, and I think it's really a safe way to go. Don't be that greedy guy who's looking to get you know, who says, oh, this is a 9.8, you know what I mean? Because somebody's 9.8 may not be your 9.8, and then you're gonna get it returned, you're gonna get bad or negative feedback, you know what I mean? So watch out for that. So all in all, I'm super happy because I thought, I thought this one, no, this one was gonna be a 9.6, that's what I thought, and I thought this one would be a 9.4. So I mean, hey, a 9.8 and a 9.6, phenomenal, man. So total, both were shipped, uh, shipping probably like 100, $110. And then, you know, of course, I had to do the CGC thing. Which brings me into my next rant. You may or may not be able to see that. I don't think you'll be able to see it. Anyways, the whole point is, I got these books back. Let me see, I ordered it January 8th. Today is February 19th. Um, yeah, so, okay, a month and a week, right? So let's call it five weeks, give or take a couple days, right? This came back five weeks. That was it, you know what I mean? That's how long it took. Well, I submitted some books to CBCS. This was like late November or very early December. I don't remember the exact date. It was like November 28th or like December 2nd, right? Let's just call it, let's just call it uh, December 1st, right? So we got December, I've been waiting. We got um, January, I've been waiting. We got February midway right now, I've been waiting. So let's just call it three months just for the fun of it. Okay, you could say two and a half, but let's just call it three months. Now, I have just been told that they have just began to take the people that are now grading my books. So what does that mean? That means they said it's gonna be another 52 business days or 55 business days additional to the already two and a half, three months that I've waited. Are you kidding me? Are you serious right now? It's gonna take six months, half a year? Ugh, this, is, this is terrible business, guys. CBCS has disappointed me beyond belief. Are you kidding me? Half of a year? I, I just can't believe this, man. I, I just can't believe this. And this is, this is for me unbelievable because CGC has always been the king, right? The top dog. And I said, you know what, man? Since they're at the Comic Con in, in Florida, I said, you know what, man? I'm gonna give the smaller guy a chance. I'm gonna give CBCS a chance, you know? Because I don't want to just give all the business to the big guy. I like to help the smaller guy. And this is what they do to you, man. This is what they give you. Now I'm not talking about the fast track because I have no idea about the fast track. I couldn't possibly speak about the fast track. But what I know is CGC is the bomb, okay? Five weeks total, that's great, man. I know PGEX, people always say, man, that's like, uh, like what, three weeks or something? Fast track, two weeks, something like that? Like, it's incredible, man. And it's really sad. Right now, I could cancel my order, get it shipped back to me, send them the PGX, get it back, and still get it faster, probably by a month, then CBCS could do it for me. This for me is unacceptable. This is not how you make yourself well known. What you need to do is, is, is I don't know, hire three more graders, hire two more whatever, shippers, I don't care, whatever you're doing, you know, you guys are obviously making money, right? You have a huge line, you know, the demand is humongous. I don't know, and that's not my problem as a consumer, to figure out your business for you. Maybe you can't find enough licensed personnel. I don't care. I, I really don't want to hear those excuses, you know what I mean? I don't care. There's no reason that you tell me it can take three to four months. That's what they told me in person, three to four months. And then this happens, or are you, like what type of business model are you running here, CBCS? I do not appreciate it. I do not respect what you're doing. I do not um, accept what you're doing. This is absolute garbage. You, you know, like if I tell somebody, 
it's gonna take me a month to roof their home. The reason I tell them a month is because that's the worst scenario, right? I know really realistically it takes me a month or two, right? But I'm gonna tell them a month, that way they're not disappointed, right? That's how the world kind of works. You don't tell me three to four months, worst scenario, and six months is what we're looking like, you know what I mean? Absolutely terrible. And uh, they refunded me like $17 or something, but I bought like five books, so I appreciate the $17, right? I do, it's cool. But at the same time, I would never do business with you again. Like, you didn't actually give me cash. You gave me $17 with CBCS. And the only way, maybe, but probably not, I would consider is fast track with y'all. But I feel so disrespected and I feel like this is terrible business practice. You know what I mean? I need it. I would assume you guys would give an apology letter to people. You know what I mean? This is just absolute trash. So, what am I doing now with this whole grading thing? I made this video because maybe if you see my other video, I'm pretty much gonna go to PGX. Hands down, PGX is gonna be my new thing. Now, if it's gonna be a bigger book, you know what I mean? Of course, I'm not gonna do that, right? If it's gonna be something that like, I'm gonna protect my family with, I definitely probably would, not not probably, I definitely wouldn't get that, like a, an Amazing Spider-Man number four, you know what I mean? I would, I would go with CGC or Amazing Spider-Man number one. I would just go with CGC just because I know it's gonna resell. And yeah, you know, you never know, man. You never know what could happen with these comic books. So PGX for me is gonna be everything mid-level and lower from now on, you know what I mean? And I do hope that other people will do that. And I'm not asking you to, but I hope one day, you know, PGX is looked at just like the others. Like, I feel like, of course, CGC is number one and CBCS is, is right there, I think, people's minds. And then PGX is kind of lower. But in my mind, man, PGX is right there with CBCS and a little bit lower than CGC, but I really don't mind the PGX. Like these days, they're not really for sale on eBay that much but I am willing to spend almost, not as much, almost as much money on a PGX book as I would for CGC. The gradings are nearly identical. They really are, man. We've seen the videos. I was gonna make one myself, <clears throat> decided not to because it would just be a big money pit for no reason. But honestly, they're really the same, man. The grading is, is just so close. And for me, I'm not into that. I'm 26 years old, right? Let's just say I wait six months, okay? You guys know how fast New Year's comes every year, Christmas comes every year. And the older you get, the faster time goes. Personally, I do not want to wait six months ever again. And I've only waited the three, but I know it's going to be six months because they've already guaranteed me at least a minimum of 55 business days to give me my book back. Now that is to just be graded. That is not to ship it to me, okay? <sighs> oh my God. God, are you kidding me? Like maybe another week or two, maybe a month with these people. You know what I mean? I just think it's unacceptable. And um, I, oh, like I said, it, I, I, oh, wow. So I'm not going to keep rambling. Let me know what you guys think of my pickups, the two silks. I think I got a pretty decent eye, um, you know, uh, saying 9.4, 9.6, and it ended up being 9.6, 9.8 is very conservative for me. And I, and I always like to do that. Will you be going with PGX? Are you sticking with CBCS? Have you submitted with them? With you know, am I crazy? Were your times half as much as mine? Let me know in the comments below, everybody. Make sure to check out some of my other videos. And uh, hey, if all else fails, make sure to subscribe. Peace out.